Hey, how's it going ladies and gentlemen on the internet? My name is Doodles. We are back once again with a brand new video for you guys. And today we are doing part five of my Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu playthrough. In the last episode, we took on Brock and we got the Pewter City Gym Badge called the Board Badge. As you can see, it is down below. Just there with all the other badges. It's the only one that's not greyed out. And that is because we finally own it. So now it is time to move on from Pewter City. We've got our Bulbasaur in tow, my favourite Pokemon of all time. And we're going to head into the next section of the game. We're going to head towards Mount Moon into Cerulean City. And then we're going to get the second gym badge. And then beyond that. So, right, it's rock and roll. Right, it's a border badge you got from Brock, didn't you? When you get new gym badges, more items become available for you. The Pokemon, by the way. Okay. Oh, so maybe we should head there before we head off. Cool. Let's go and check it out. But yeah, hopefully guys have been enjoying this series so far. I have been waiting for this day for 20 years. I am so happy it is finally here. So hopefully guys are just as happy as I am. If you are, make sure you give this video a big fat thumbs up. If you're new around here, make sure you subscribe with notifications on. Click the subscribe button, click the notification bell, then click all. That way you'll never miss out on a video goes live on the channel. But let's see what the um, Pokemon has. Oh, he's got great balls now. He's got skate ropes that could come in really, real handy for the... Uh, Mount Moon, I think we'll get one of them. We'll get one of them for Mount Moon because uh, that could that could definitely come in handy. Also, we're going to get five Great Balls. I sort of feel we should get a Burn Heal, just in case. And maybe another Antidote. Just to be on the safe side. Just to be on the safe side. But there we go. We're spent up. We're skint. We're broke. As we are in real life as well, so. Right, let's head off towards Mount Moon. Let's get it on. Right, here we are. We're on Route 3. Well, oh, some odd new trainers to battle here. Might as well start with the first one. Good way to farm some experience points. Hopefully, we'll get our Metapod up to level 10. And then it will be able to become a Butterfree. That's what I'm excited for. Sent out an Oddish. Probably not the best Pokemon to uh, fight with because I've got a, a Bulbasaur. No, I'm using Pikachu. Right, that'll do. Oh, it's level 6 anyway. So I think it's going to make a difference either way, is it? Oh, thought that might have killed it. Thought that might have killed it, if I've been perfectly honest. Maybe I should use Quick Attack. We'll soon find out. Yeah, I should use quick attack. Should he use quick attack? Now, there we go, beat last Janice. There's an item here, sweet. Three more Pokeballs, that'll come in handy. Not going to complain about that at all. There's an item there, we're going to go and get that as well. Right, oh, you're the new trainer. I'm a coach trainer. Coach trainers are the ones who stand in various places to train trainers. I'm one of them. We coach trainers are strong, if I do say so myself. If you want to try out your strength, you should definitely battle us. Okay. Yeah, can do. Let's go for it. Let's rock and roll. Let's get it on. We've got a Bulbasaur as well. Sweet. What level is his Bulbasaur? 11. Well, that's higher than mine, I think. I think it's mine. I think mine's got level 9. Yeah, Pikachu being seeded is... um. When you grow up, kids, you'll learn what that means in the real world. I won't spoil it for you guys now. Lose some more health there. How much? Oh, quite a little bit actually. Well, this Bulbasaur has been a bit more difficult than I anticipated it being. May have to use a potion. I don't really want a Pikachu fainting. Might be worth getting rid of Pikachu. Maybe for the Nidavan. We'll go for the Nidavan. Yeah. 
because we're going to be using losing like five HP every turn anyway, so we might as well escape that. We're just going to waste portions of a wise. So yeah, I think it's probably, that was probably the wise wise call. Right, we avoided it. That's good. Try Peck, see if this does anything better. Right, there we go. Super effective, I should use that from the start. Right, I know now. Flying in grass is a good thing. Right. He did say he was a strong trainer, so that's kind of why the bulb saw is probably a little bit more difficult than we anticipated it being. But he's gonna learn horn attack. Right, what have we got to get rid of? We'll get rid of focus energy. Still waiting for Metapod to become level 10. It's taking his sweet time. Right, you defeated Coach Trains like that. In honor of your strength, I have a gift for you. You've got a revive. Sweet. Right, we're going to head over to the pork mark. I keep meaning to run. I don't know. We're running. We're fine. We're good. Yeah, rather than using uh, loads of potions, I'm just going to use this to go to the Pokemon Center. Just make it makes more sense, I think, in my opinion. We're right next to it anyway, so I could take much time. Good stuff. Such a peaceful song. Right, let's go and take on the next trainer. Unless there's an item first, and then we'll go and get the item first. Which is just down here. Swell ourselves a little bit of that. We've got a portion. You never have too many. The only time you have too many is when you when you max out. Then you got too many. Right, my shots are cool, right? You can stare at them. Rather not. Bit creepy. Right, turned by youngster Calvin. It's now Spiro. Which is gonna be a one hit kill, I imagine. It's not gonna fare too well against his Thundershock. I'll tell you that one for free, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Oh, that is speed water and yeah, that was super quick. Yeah, that was super quick. I want to train up my Pikachu because obviously we've got the water gym coming up, so it makes sense to use Pikachu a lot more. Right, he's our next trainer. I'll battle you with a Pokemon I just caught. Fine. Fine by me. Fine by me, girl. That's a boy. Victor. Nidorino. Ooh. Oh, it's Nidoran. Thought there's any Nidorino there. My bad. My bad. Oh, close, but no cigar. Well, it was very effective, so it's pretty pointless there, wasn't it, mate? There we go, that's Nidoran taken care of. We've got two great balls for that, nice. Oh, is that a Sandshrew? We'll have that. I like Sandshrew, I like Sand Slash. Sand Slash is one of my favorite Pokemon in Gen 1. Something a little bit different as well. Before you add him to the... Um, to the team once we get Beedrill, maybe. And maybe we'll swap Oddish out for him. Oh, we got, we're going to get, uh, we're going to get uh, Butterfree. Sweet, level 14, 10, 10, and 9. And we nearly got our Beedrill as well, which is cool. Four level ups in one. Not bad at all. 
Right, here we go, my second favourite Pokemon of all time. Butterfree we are about to get. And we've already got them in the past, but it's going to be part of our team now, which is super sweet. There we go. We have ourselves a Butterfree. That's so cool. Got Butterfree and Bulbasaur on my team. I'm a very it's like it's like Pokemon Red all over again. Apart from the Oddish, this is a pretty similar team to what I would have had in there, uh, Pokemon Red. By now. It's also we got the Oddish really, really early. Oh, it's a monkey as well. Well, it's always a monkey. We get him first time. Oh, I thought it was going to be a little cheeky one. Cheeky monkey. Cheeky monkey. Probably be a better way to describe him. Oh, come on, I've got to use a boomy. That was rubbish. Why isn't he throwing the Pokeballs? Why wasn't it throwing the Pokeball straight? There we go. Got has a monkey as well. That's super cool. Oh, Oddish level 13. Sweet. I'm going to forget growth. Awesome. Got ourselves a monkey. That's super cool. Very happy with that one. Let's talk to this trainer next. Eek, did you push me? No. Picnic and Robin. He's only got one Pokemon as well. Need to run female this time. All right. Level 7 as well. Not very powerful, these Pokemon. That's the best you've got for me. Got two Pokeballs there. Sweet. That speed or yeah, just for the experience, we'll get it. This level seven is actually better than the one that we've got now, so excellent. That's how you do it. Oh. So we'll see which one's better, which one's got the better stats. And we'll keep the one that's got the better stats. There we go. Sweet. <laughs> right, another trainer here. Let's take him on. Hi, I like shorts. They're comfy and easy to wear. So do I. So do I, but it's not winter. I'm always in shorts all the time. All the time. Like youngster Ben, my cousin's called Ben actually. <laughs> One shot, didn't put much of a fight, did you? Right, here's number one. Are you trained? Let's get to it right away. Yes, sir. Greg. Kuna. Probably just going to harden, so not going to much of a fight. Yep, use Harden. Literally, didn't put up a fight at all. Mm -hmm. 
Right, what Pokemon are around here? Oh, there's an item there. We'll have it. Oh, another sand troop. Sweet, I might get it. See which one moves a higher level than the one we just got. Don't run away from this. Oh, it's like level four. There's gonna be nowhere near as good, but oh well. Bit of experience points, never go miss. There we go. Level 11, Bulbasaur, and level 13, Nidoran. Nice. Not bad at all. What does this dude want? Just taking a little rest. This one from Cerulean City takes a lot out of you. Hello there. I'm a coach trainer at your service. Do you want to train a bit before taking a Mount Moon? Sure. Sure. Let's go for it. Right, coach trainer Obreon, Obron, Oberon. Don't know how you pronounce the name. Right, Meowth. Ooh. I'm sure that's an EV exclusive. I don't think we can get it in Let's Go Pikachu. Level 13 as well. Ooh. Let's cool, but, uh, put up a little bit of a fight. But we'll get them back when we beat them anyway, so that's fine. At least you just inconvenience me by having to make me pick up my own money. That's literally all you're doing. You're not stealing it. There we go, that is Meowth taking care of. Didn't put much of a fight at all. So we just picked up our money again. So, never mind. Right, that was a great battle tape. This is thanks. TM57 payday. Don't really have a need for it. Anything around for us to explore? Grab any items? Stuff doesn't look like it. What does she want? Right, I tripped over a Geodude lying on the ground. So okay. Got an escape rope. That could come in handy. I've already bought one, but that could come in handy nonetheless. I can't Mount Moon from far away because I want a Pokemon I can ride on. That's right, you can ride on certain Pokemon like Onyx. Do we get the Magikarp here? I've got all my Pokeballs in my belt. One, two, three, five, six. Yep, that'll do. No matter how many Pokemon you have in your Pokebox, you only take six in the battle. Yo, when Jigglypuff sings, Pokemon get drowsy. Me too. Right, when you try and catch a Pokemon, yeah, you sometimes see a green ring. That kind of Pokemon is easy to catch. If, it, if it's yellow, it's a bit harder. If it's red, that might be really hard to catch, okay? You catch a lot of Pokemon into it more than you can carry in your party, but all the ones you can't carry go in your box. Hello there, sweetie pie. I've got a deal for you. I'll let you have a secret Pokemon Magic Card for just 500. Then you'll buy them on my right. Damn right, I will. Of course I will. I know we can just fish for one, but we can get one now, and we can start to train it up to be a Gyarados, which is obviously going to take a little while to do. I really want that Beedrill sat and something party out. I might not put sand through and I might just put magic carp in and keep the rest as is. I'm not entirely sure yet what I'm gonna do. I'll figure that out. 
as time comes but for now that is the end of the video guys we've just made our way all the way from pewter city to mount moon but seeing as we're 20 minutes in it's probably going to be a good time to wrap this up because i don't know how long mount moon is going to take it's probably going to take at least 20 minutes so it should probably be its own separate video so hopefully guys enjoyed this one today if you did if you want to see more like this on the channel make sure you give this video a big fat thumbs up if you're new around here make sure you subscribe and notifications on click subscribe button click the notification bell then click all that way you'll never miss out on a video goes live on the channel and on screen now there'll be some videos for you to check out as well as a playlist for my pokemon let's go pikachu and eevee playlist if you miss any of the previous episodes or you want to see the future episodes they'll all be in that playlist my name is jules i thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys next time